Hello, uh, my name is Trupti Dathe. Today I'm going to give information about cancer. So, cancer is a hot topic nowadays. Uh, every one out of four has cancer. So cancer is the uncontrollable growth of the cell. But this cancer cells are different from the normal cells. So how to differentiate the cancer cell and normal cells? In normal cells, uh, they have the property of cell division and apoptosis. Apoptosis is programmed cell death, but in the uh, cancer cells, the property of apoptosis is absent. So the ca carcinogenous cells undergoes uncontrollable uh, growth and forms a mass of cell, which is uh, what we call tumor. But all the tumors are not harmful. So in order to understand which are harmful and which are not, we need to learn two types of tumor, which are benign tumor and malignant tumor. In case of the benign tumor, uh, the tumor stays at one place and hence uh, it is less harmful and non-cancerous. But on the other hand, the malignant tumor uh, in the tumor which leaks from one place and spreads to different organs. So it is cancerous and harmful tumor. Uh, for treatment of the benign tumor, surgeries are uh, uh, preferred in which the benign tumor is completely removed but in case of malignant tumor many therapies such as radiation therapy and chemotherapy are used in the radiation therapy certain radiations are given to reduce the uh, spread of the tumor and in the chemotherapy certain drugs are given to reduce the tumor the types of cancer are uh, carcinoma sarcoma and leukemia carcinoma includes uh, stomach cancer, lung cancer, breast cancer and the sarcoma includes the bone cancer and the leukemia includes the blood cancer. Uh, for the treatment of the cancer, previously uh, detection was done by uh, BioSP method which is removal of the skin tissues uh, from the infected area uh, which undergoes histopathological study and detection of cancer cells was done. Another method is CT scan in which x-rays is passed through the patient's bodies. Uh, but this type of determining method is not really preferable uh, because x-rays are itself cancer causing. And another method is MRI which is best suited method. So as I previously mentioned, for the treatment, surgery is used in the benign tumor and chemotherapy and radiation therapy are used in the malignant tumor. Another therapy is immunotherapy in which alpha interferons are given to the patient to stimulate or activate the immune system. Uh, after determination of cancer, it is important to determine the stage at which the cancer is. So the scale, uh, stage is measured from the scale of uh, 0 to 4. The symptoms of cancers are fatigue, uh, weight loss, hair loss, uh, thickening of the areas under the skin. Uh, cancer is uh, more prone to old age and genes also play an important role in cancer. Uh, skin type 1 and 2 are more prone to cancer than the skin type 5 and 6. Uh, males are 16% uh, more prone to this cancer than females. Cancer can happen to anyone. It's not specific to any kind of person. So for you to overcome it, we should have a daily lap. Uh, life, uh, maintain a healthy lifestyle and eat healthy for us to not fall victim to this deadliest disease. The gene that causes cancer is the oncogene. Cancer can occur through various agents uh, like viruses or the physical agent or chemical agent. Also, uh, Cancer affects your mind more than it affects your body. But quitting is no answer. Some people may have strong and uh, steady. Some people have to be strong and steady to help their families and have many pressing issues. You can be in the situation of denial or overwhelmed with your current situation. 
but all you have to do is cope up with it positively and you have to select if you have to be a warrior or a warrior and in india over 800000 uh, people are diagnosed every year so it is really important to spread awareness about cancer thank you